Yes, ma'am. They made all of us come to the school today because it went viral on the internet that he was allowing the students to do his hair. My daughter was doing his hair. One thing I'm not understanding is, why you doing his hair, but you can't do my hair? And honestly, I don't see the problem. It's a lot of videos on the internet with the women teachers either doing the kids' hair or the kids doing putting wigs on, dollar cheap wigs. Maybe they're expensive. They look a little cheap to me. But now all of a sudden, y'all got a man getting his hair taken down by the students and it's a problem. Like, is it because he's a he's a African-American or is it because he's a man? All I know is he fine. So, you know, I came up to this school. This is my chance. I'm finna come in there and I'm finna be like, when I walk into class, y'all y'all want to sit there and do his hair, do mine. That's my only problem. That's my only problem. I've been waiting for this man for so long to get his attention. Now, he'll look at me a little smile a little bit. That man is fine. Right. And then I asked my daughter when she came home, like, why are you taking down his hair? But you can't even help me. Look at this little ponytail I got going. But you can't even help me. with my, I, don't, I really don't understand that. But now that he's sad and since the Internet that took over and stuff. This is my time to comfort him and make him feel like he ain't wrong. I ain't worried about all that other stuff. But this is my time to get my man. Let that man go. And they talking about if y'all want us to fire him, we'll do a suspension. We don't want none of that. We don't, what, what we want him suspended for, we can't look at him no more. But I'm going to get that man. All right, come on. Y'all already interviewed the other mamas? All right, come on. This one? What you mean is live? 